Hey everyone, it's Pink Play 74. Oh, welcome back to another video of Restaurant Tycoon 2. Uh, this is the third episode of this series. I'm just loving this game. It is so fun. Um, but I remember in the last episode, I've started the redesigning of my restaurant, and I've got 200 big ones in the bank, which is very good. So let me collect this reward real quick. Uh, let's just collect select the kids' meal. Uh, so I need to open my restaurant back up then. Because I think it's closed, which is why no one's coming. So let's open the restaurant up. Um, I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to get the waiter trays just so I can carry some more items. Um, a VIP customer. Oh my god. Very good, very good. Here you go. So you guys get the big table. Because there's a big group of you. You damn fools. Why don't you use the door? You know what? I'm not going to question you. Uh, so in this video i want to hire a chef or a waiter i'm not sure which one yet though it's table for two yes collect all you guys orders and now i can get three on my thing at once my little plate or serving tray i don't know and then give that to you guys and then much easier much much easier for me now it's table for two yes there's one over here for you you damn fools, go sit down. Uh, so let me open this door. Uh, so you guys are drinking, you guys are drinking, you guys are looking at the drinks menu. And now you ordered a goddamn drink. So let's give you guys drinks. Uh, and then collect you guys' drinks as well. There's a VIP customer at this table, so I do want to be focusing on this big table. Collect you guys' dishes. Of course, of course. I can, I'm just going to start cooking for them straight away. I'm not going to worry about the other uh, tables yet. Because, you know, there's only two. And they're, they're of twos. So this, this table is going to give me the most cash. Which is why I need to focus on it. So blend that up. Chop this up. Put it in the oven. Um, so let's cook this up then. See if I can see it. I can see it in there. Uh, it's quite cool that you can see it while it's being whilst this is being cooked. So let's put that in there then. Wait for that to finish up, and then yeah. So wait for that. To take it out of the oven, and then cook the last thing for them, which is the garlic bread. Which I can do that. I can do that. You damn fool. So let's take this out of the oven when it's done. So it's nearly there. So take that out, and then. There we go. Got all three of you. And it's just that thing for the VIP customer that I don't have now. So the vegetable soup. Give that to you. You guys are eating. Collect you guys the dishes. And then start cooking for you guys as well. So let's chop this up. It's a nice quiche. Yeah, I can see it in there cooking. <laughs> it's like it's in my hand. <laughs> um, so let's take this out of the oven then. Cook. Let's, uh, grate the cheese. <laughs> This is quite cool. Uh, cook it up then. It's nice, some nice nachos. <laughs> it doesn't look very nice in there though. Uh, nachos in the quiche. Give that to you, fools. Collect you guys' dishes so you guys look at the menu. Uh, more nachos. I can do that. So let's grate the cheese and then put it in the oven as well. So let's cook that up. Uh, let's see if you guys, yeah, you guys have ordered your mains so get that S take that out of the oven and just gonna start like I'm just gonna put this in the oven first and then I'm gonna go serve uh, the other customer so let's put that in there get the nachos let me through the door there you go uh, give that to you collect you guys' dishes I heard the oven pop which means take that out and then fry the next person's dish so I'm getting quite quick at this now because I know how to nav navigate through my restaurant. So let's put the ketchup on the hot dog. Uh, let's put the mac and cheese on the stove. And let's give the vegetable pizza and the hot dog to you fools. No through the door. These doors are so small. Uh, my food is burning. No, it's not anymore. Take that out. Put it in here. Pretty sure this is nachos. Uh, actually, I, I don't know. I don't know. That was mac and cheese. It's fine, it's fine. I can give that to you. Collect you guys' dishes. 
uh, make sure this doesn't burn cook two more things before I can start cooking for the other tables so I'm not sure what this is but I'm cooking the meat on first oh it's a cheese steak so let's wrap it all up then wrap 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 and then just the last thing which is a pepperoni pizza so I'm gonna put that in the oven and then serve um, these two fools their food so let's give that to you guys and it's just that pepperoni pizza so let's take that out of the oven give the pepperoni pizza to this table because we don't want the VIP customer to be waiting because it'll go, uh, make our rating go down which we don't want so let's add the sauce and then cook that up actually I should probably just be waiting for it so let's take that out of the oven cook the next thing which is some spaghetti and meatballs so pepperoni pizza who wanted it? Uh, you wanted that go back through here uh, finish that up and then cook the nice meat uh, finish that up and then put some sauce on it as well there we go cook the next thing it's another pizza the pizzas are very popular on this menu especially the vegetable pizza but the pepperoni pizza does quite well as well so spaghetti and meatballs give it to you full collect you guys' dishes so you guys don't have to wait as long take that out the oven um, I should really give this to him first uh, there you go get you guys' orders yep cook the next thing for um, that customer there who's just waiting like a damn fool so let's cook this up then finish it and wrap it which is a nice beef wellington I'm sure he's gonna enjoy it so put that in there wait for that to cook up and then I'll do the three desserts for the VIP table so beef wellington give that to you so, um, collect you guys dishes as well and then cook the th the Bakewell tart for someone, not sure, one of the damn fools. Uh, close the trap. So, it actually, looks quite nice. But the Bakewell tart's in there, take that out. And now I'm having a brownie. Oh, it looks very nice. Very nice indeed, you damn fool. So, let's wait for this to go up then. And take it out of the oven and cook it. Let's give the chocolate brownie and the Bakewell tart to whoever wanted them. And then just need to get this off the oven and put the sauce on it. Just like that. Grab that and give it to you. Cheesecake, got it. Collector rewards. Two new dishes. So steak burrito and chili con carne. Perfecto, perfecto. Uh, cook the cheesecake in the oven looks very nice very nice indeed so we'll wait for this then and then we'll wait for them to finish their food because they're on their dessert so which means they'll be paying soon which means I get some sweet cash money moolah so you want an apple pie which I can do collect you guys' dishes oh perfect VIP customer 2.6 stars not bad at all and a lot of cash another VIP customer he looks very rich actually uh, so let me quickly cook this then I'm getting a lot of VIP customers maybe it's because um, let me get for, go through here there you go maybe it's because of how nice my restaurant looks I'm not sure but they they all want to be coming to my restaurant so it's fine by me collect you guys' cash so now I want to think about hiring a waiter or a chef. I think I'm going to do a chef because then um, they can start cooking for me as soon as possible. And then I don't have to be cooking as much and I can just be serving the da these damn fools. So let me put you in here. Uh, table for two. For you guys. So you guys are drinking. You're finishing up in like now. Collect the cash. I could also get a waiter as well right now, but that's fine. That's fine. I don't. I don't need a waiter yet. So let's cook the you. Give the table to you. Collect you guys' dishes because I know you guys are almost done. This guy's very golden. <laughs> you guys gotta be done right. Yeah. Collect you guys' dishes. You guys are gonna think about what you want. 
What are you watching, you damn fools? Yep, 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 yep. And let me get you guys' drinks first. And then we can start cooking. This guy's not going to start cooking yet because he's a trainee. So I need to show him the way. So you put you put the tomato soup on the stove. And then, yeah, you kind of just take it off. Um, yeah, it's very, very easy being a cook. Just do that, okay? He's out. He's outside there. What are you doing, you damn fool? You're supposed to be watching me. <laughs> uh, that's fine, that's fine. Uh, take that out of the oven. Boil that on. So he, I have to cook three more dishes. Yeah, three more dishes. So after this one, it'll just be... You've got to be looking at what I'm doing, not waiting out there. Uh, take that out and then cook this one. So I'm not going to be able to get him cooking yet. Because first we have to boil it. I do want to quickly give the food to these guys though. Uh, collect you guys' dishes so you guys are looking at the menu. Uh, make sure that doesn't burn. Give the tomato soup to you. Nachos, pork pie and bitter ballon. Got it, got it, got it. Uh, cook. I'm pretty sure I can cook at the same time as him. I'm hoping I can because otherwise I'm going to have to get another set of this. But that's fine, that's fine. So let's cook that in there. And then wait for that. Uh, take out the oven. Uh, grate the cheese. And put that in the oven as well. Oh look, he's a level one chef. Yeah, so it looks like we can do it at the same time, which is perfect. Take that out. Also put get the nachos on my plate. Or serving tray. Collect you guys' dishes. So my chef seems to be cooking the... Oh, he's already cooked it. Very nice, very nice. So a lot of things to cook there for them, guys. So my chef will be helping me out. So let's boil this. Yeah, so we can use the same one at the same time. Perfecto. Which means I can hire loads of chefs and just have have them use this. And then get, like, uh, different types of things. So if I go into build mode in the kitchen, there seems to be, like, loads of stuff so that I can fit, fit it all in here. And they can just share. Because they should share. You know? I'm not that rich. Uh, collect you guys' dishes and then help my chef cook all of these because there are there are, there are a lot I'll, I'll give it to my chef there are a lot of things to cook so I'll help him out so then we can cook it a little bit quicker uh, so let's cook you take it out of the oven chop it I mean fridge I don't know why I said oven that's not an oven that's a fridge it's a fridge freezer so let me put that and then take that off the oven. So there's a lot of things to give. They're, yeah, they're probably waiting. So if I take these orders, then my chef will start to cook those up. And then give the ravioli to you. There we go. Quest completed. I didn't even know there was a quest. Perfect. So I've got 400 big ones in the bank. So I'm expanding very quickly, which is very good. So the restaurant, I can get a tip jar. I can get an expanded plot soon. Or I can get basic advertising. But none of that stuff's really necessary. I think the next thing I want to do is I just want to get another chef. So that I'm cooking as quick as possible. Because that will be very nice. So let's give chicken nuggets to you. No, no, you. Sorry. Sorry, you damn fool. Um, so he's done that. And then I can give that to you. So you guys start eating. Collect you guys' dishes. So once this guy, this VIP customer is done, I... He's going to give me like 100 cash, which is perfecto. So then I, um, I'm i going to help my chef, because there's a lot. But um, after that, I should be able to hire another chef. So I just need to teach that chef, and then he'll be cooking as well. So then I can have two chefs on the go. And then that'll be a lot quicker than just the one chef. And then if I help them as well, there'll be three people cooking in total. So like three dishes instead of just being one being made. So that's very nice. Very nice indeed. I'm going to give these this to this table so that they start eating because we don't want them to wait for too long because we don't want our waiting time to be very high because that means our rating will go down so currently we're a 1.6 star pretty sure last episode we were a 1.7 star but that's fine that's fine we're making some pancakes for them uh grab these please thank you um then give that to you guys collect that cash as well collect you give that to you collect you what do you think you damn fool 
You wish you ordered a cheesecake now, don't you? He's like, God damn it, I should have gotten the cheesecake or the brownie. Uh, table for two. One right there. And there should be someone else coming soon to fill in that table. That is fine, that is fine. My chef's like, God damn it, let me cook. Um, so you guys are almost done. Yeah, you guys want coffee, pineapple juice. I'm just going to do this just so it's a bit quicker. Give that to you. Put you there. Collect you guys' dishes. 114 cash. But what is my rating? What is my rating? 2.6 stars. Not bad, not bad. So I've got 700. Perfecto. I can hire a new chef. So I've got two chefs in now and serve just the usual one. Uh, well, not usual, but you know, you know what I mean. There's no VIP customer for this table. That's fine. So I'm thinking actually of maybe getting another table and chair. Maybe I should get rid of this wall. Uh, because I was thinking if I put that there place I don't there you go. Uh, and then chairs So then there'll be two two seats there, two seats there. Okay, so I didn't make this very even. That's fine. So maybe if I put this here. Try to think how they're gonna get in. These damn fools have no way of getting in. Um Hmm. <laughs> okay, that's a predicament. Uh God damn it. Uh, I don't want to empty my restaurant. I'm thinking maybe I can do something like this instead. Actually, and then put... Which way is this facing? There you go. That like that, and that like that. So there's a table like that, and then I'm going to move that chair to be there. Oh, wait, no, because then... Hmm. I want that to be there. Sell that and sell that. Move that to be... Okay, yeah, I know what I'm going to do. I know what I do. You just have to trust the process. Collect the, my rewards. Uh, grilled corn as a kid's meal as well. Collect you guys' dishes. Um, give you guys some stuff. Give you guys. Get you guys cooking. I also need to um, train this chef. So I'm going to start training him now. So that he becomes a level one chef. So then he can start cooking as well. Because we need him to be cooking. So let's cook this up. Finish it. Add the sauce to the spaghetti meatballs. Uh, and then let's take this as well. Just so. God damn it. He keeps being outside. But that's fine. Uh, take this out of the oven. Add the sauce. And like that. So, spaghetti, that, that, collect you guys' dishes, table for two, got it. In fact, I'm going to close my restaurant now. Close my restaurant. I'm a croissant, yes, you can do, I can do that. I can do that, you damn fool. Train this, oh, I, don't, I can't train him. Uh, bottle of water and a cola, sure thing. So he wants a croissant, and he's cooking the croissant now. That level one chef, not the trainee. So get this croissant, give it to you. Collect you guys' dishes. <laughs> but I'm thinking maybe I can have the door here instead. And then like the walls here. Uh, so let me take these orders, and then I can cook one. So that my trainee's chef is a bit closer to leveling up to that first level. So he can cook as well. Uh, how long's left? There you go. So let's take this out the oven then. Perfecto. Chocolate brownie bakewell tart. Give that to you guys. Collect you guys' dishes. So they're all looking at our menu basically. Oh my god, there's so much to cook now. Uh, cook you. So he's he just needs to be taught two more dishes. So I just need to cook this one and then one more. Which is fine by me take that out of the oven cook this last dish so he's cooking as well so that there's gonna be two cookers whilst I can deal out there deal out there 
So finish that up, chop it all up. Uh, give this to you guys. Uh, cheeseburger. Collect you guys' cash. A mac and cheese. Who wanted the mac and cheese? It's you, you fool. Uh, I'm going to help them out as well. I'm just going to cook one thing. Because, you know, they can, they can cook the other two. So, great. Uh, I was about to say great this. No, cook cook the meat. And then make the beef. Wrap the wheat beef wellington up. And cook that all up. And then that should be good enough. So, give you guys you things. Collect you guys' cash. And now I can actually move this to how I wanted it. So then, like that. So then I can have a doorway here. They can walk through here and go to this table. They can go to this table and they can go to these tables. I think that would look nice. That would look very nice. So, construction, walls. What is this short wall? Oh, it's a one wall instead. Okay, okay. It's very nice, very nice. Chicken. There you go. Collect you guys' dishes. So, with walls. No, with doors. Huh. No, I want like a... Yeah, maybe like a door like that. And then they... Actually, no. I don't know what I'm doing. I might just leave this open. So, apple pie for you. Got it. Collect you guys' dishes. But I want like... Um, walls. Maybe I can make this glass as well. Let's put like you, like that. And then I can have glass walls along here and then like a, just a normal wall yeah I think I know what I'm gonna do but it's gonna take a second or two but that's fine so I need some sweet cash money moolah apple pie for you my chefs are cooking so very nice very nice god damn ate it quicker you fool so they're cooking uh, for these this this duo or this pair uh, come on you stupid chefs cook faster you fools uh, hot dog and he's still cooking so hot dog for you I said hot dog for you you damn fool do you not want your hot dog there you go collect the dishes for you guys no the game just wants to be slow yeah, the game's just deciding to be slow. It's not good. Collect the cash from you guys. And then I want to collect the cash from you guys. So hurry up, you dare fools. Um, so let's go back to walls then. So I'm thinking of like having two windows here. And then like a short wall here. I think that would look nice. And then I can have a stairway going up here. Across this wall. And then like a little railing. Yeah, I, I, I think I know what I'm going to go for. I think I know, you fools. Uh, but it's going to take some time. That's fine. That's fine. Collect you guys' dishes. And then wait for you guys to see what you want for dessert. You want nothing. So I got 37 cash then. So I've got 121 big ones in the bank. Um, and these chefs are just waiting there like a dead fool. Um, yeah, I think that's going to end it. End this episode. If you did enjoy, please make sure you like and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye.